today we're on Operation Pow, or P-O-W. Two of our scouts have been taken captive. Oh, this mission. This is one of those missions that people either love or they hate. There's really no middle ground, and I... I think I fall on the hate side of things just because you have to use a light recon for a lot of this mission. It is such a pain in the rectal area. My god, you're about to see. Oh, they can. You just gotta get close, Betty. Good to see you again, Commander. Now listen up, because we need to move fast. It's not good to hear you again, Betty, that's for sure. There's a tank. Hi, tank. During their assault on Windbreak Ridge, the Tundrans captured two of our scouts. They are holding them in this base. Technically, it's really only one scout, because it's a light, one light recon, Your job whatever. is to rescue the scouts and use their recon to get them to the safety of our mobile camp to the north. Sounds easy enough. Sir, yes, Assault sir. the enemy base and rescue the prisoners. Those scouts are in possession of time-critical intelligence. You have less than six minutes to liberate their recon and drive them to our mobile camp. Deploy your bazooka vets against the enemy tank. I have done that. Lock onto the tank. There we go. Use the C -stick Everyone, to get in here. Bazooka veteran. Press the Y button to send them in. Destroy the barbed wire to free the prisoners. Well, certainly will, but I want to kill everybody first because my power rating may depend on it. Because it's hard to kill people when you get on the pathway here. Everyone, destroy that. You freed the prisoners, Commander. All right. Now get behind the wheel of that recon. You want to have a really light touch on the you stick for this? You out of there, Commander. Head for the gold star. Because otherwise, you're just going to end Don't up... Don't worry about the rest of our boys. They can handle themselves. Otherwise, you're going to end up fishtailing. And you're going to end up fishtailing anyway. Just run. watch me. It's going to happen. Follow the road, Commander. She'll take you all the way home. Oh, hello, rocket guy. Now, if you want to try to make, increase your chances of 100% on power... Commander. Those blue jerry cans will repair damage to your recon. The best way to do is to try to run the foot soldiers over. Don't stop to show them your papers. Left or right, left has vehicles, right's just left dangerous right, to fall off. Unicide. So if provided you can control this thing, go right. If you're worried, go left. You just gotta avoid a bunch of vehicles, that's all. I just hit that guy. Watch out for those bazooka That's awesome. They'll put a dent in this operation for sure. Yes, they will. See how much this thing fishtails? I'm like not even doing anything that dangerous. Hard right, Commander. You do not want to see what's over that ridge. Yeah, you can go through the fences and die here pretty easily. And you think that's bad? You wait till you see what you got to transgress very soon. And transgress is probably not the right word, but whatever, whatever. Let's just keep running, running for our lives here. Hey, I actually took that corner all right. I'm shocked. Of course, if I start saying how great this is going, it's going to just fall apart on me like a house of cards. Here we go. Starting to fishtail a little. Oh, yeah, here we go. Now I'm in trouble. Yes, perfect. I'm going to get shot. Oh, my God. How did I not get shot there? Okay, I'm just going to let go and get... Jesus Christ, get lined up. You transfer in from the Air Force? <laughs> Betty, you're hilarious. Wait, no. What's the other word? Annoying. My bad. Annoying. Let's see how bad the fishtailing goes, because this next area is a fishtailing man's dream if you like fishtail. Or your nightmare if you hate it, like a smart person. You have to steer going down a hill. It's really not easy in this vehicle. I cannot stress enough how badly steering in this thing sucks. Don't hit the freaking wooden strut. You gotta be able to clear that river, otherwise Your you die. Your driver is quite proficient, Brigadier Betty, but even he cannot outrun a Tundran gunship. Yeah, I can. Uh oh! Do not let that gunship get a fix on you. Okay. You're supposed to go around that barrier. It's honestly easier to crash right through it. You can hear missiles crashing all around me. Star Commander, and try not to get lost. Thank you. That means that there's there is that gunship in the sky trying to blow me to pieces. So we gotta be careful. Best to try to stick to the trail, because if you get stuck in the trees, you can get murdered in here pretty easily. And I, right after I say that, of course, I go in the tree. Oh god, I'm actually running the wrong way here. This is the other thing, it's easy to get lost in here. That went pretty well. I'll take that. That was okay. Nice driving, Commander, but we're not out of the woods yet. And 
before she warns me, you go up this hill over here, right, the jerry can is. Just follow that as your guide. Another Tundra roadblock! Find a way past! You can drive through it, but it's just easier to go past it. Plus, you get to go up this cool jump. Less than two minutes remaining! Step on it! Oh my god! This vehicle is drunk! Alright. Let's go. <laughs> Like, I didn't change my steering or anything. It just hit the ground and spun. That's why this vehicle can be a real pain to use. You did it, Commander! The Frontier Camp is dead ahead! So you want to go park over here? Now. Our scouts are safe, Commander. Okay, Commander. This baby is your ticket to victory. Take good care of our... Hopefully the missile vets will start shooting that helicopter for me before he starts blowing my guy to smithereens. Your men will not leave this clearing, Brigadier. Okay, I think they got him. Yep, there goes the smoking rack of it. <laughs> How about we prove him wrong? All right, so let's see what we got. We've got to kill all of these guys, and there's actually another gunship coming. We got to be careful. So coming first, we got rifles, we got uh, bazookas, I got a light recon, and then we've got more bazookas. Like I said, gunships and a few other guys coming. So we got to deal with all these guys. If we lose the tank, we're gonna lose a huge amount of score for this mission. You've got Act to keep them. the tank alive. Prove to them the futility of war against the Tundran territories. Oh, he just got shot with a tank shell. That had to hurt. <laughs> I gotta stop blowing myself up here. Now let's see what we got here. Let's just be careful, because we got to be careful of what's coming in. We got light recons and that, but bazookas are close behind, and they can destroy the tank if you let them. All right, light recon, you're mine. There we go. All right, guys, come back with me. Bazooka veterans, attack! Just gotta be careful. I don't back into the the jerry can. Vets pose a serious threat to your tank. Take them out with your infantry. Wisdom. Oh crap, of course I just picked it up like an idiot. And here they come for me. Oh jeez, kill him please. Before they shoot me please. Oh and if you get really low on health you can destroy your own tents looking for jerry cans. That sometimes will work. All right, so we got rid of them. What's next? We got rifles. Is there more bazookas in there? There is more bazookas. So we, it really, we want to get that bazooka guy if we can, but it's fine if we don't. Uh oh, here comes the uh, helicopter. So you want to put. So what I did was I I went across the bottom of the map or my uh, my units to put these two guys on sentry mode. And that means as soon as that gunship comes into range, these uh, missile guys are just going to start launching missiles into the sky and destroying the gunship. That's their specialty. They can't hit stuff on the ground. They can destroy stuff in the air. So you want to put them onto uh, sentry mode anytime air stuff comes nearby and they'll start taking care of you. I don't block in on them. Alright, so here's what I want to get Bazooka Vets in here helping us. So they will definitely take this guy down in a hurry for you. Nice! Work, Commander. nice. You rescued the that went pretty well. Defended the base. It was a little now hectic, that's though. What I call a victory. Uh, you can see one of my guys jumping through my tank. You have proved the most <laughs> worthy opponent, Brigadier Betty. I look forward to our <laughs> next awesome. encounter with great anticipation. I mean, it's totally ridiculous, Me but it's too, awesome. Me too, Marshal Nova. Better luck next Did time. Did she say Marshal Nova? What, does she think she's part of Oasis? Does she want to sing Champagne Supernova? Champagne Supernova in the sky? Oh, look at that. I probably lost one foot soldier, and that means I didn't get 100% technique. But still, very good score. The speed is what is the hardest one for that mission, honestly. That and keeping your tank alive. Hooray! So what's next? Alright, you get to read about the missile veteran. Read up. Useful troops to have. You get to use these babies a lot. Because the enemy use air an awful lot. 